Hi everybody, this is Aino. In this video, I'll share Fukagaya Yatai Ramen, Yu-chan. Let's go! Today, I came to Yu-chan in Monzen Nakacho, Tokyo. It serves old-fashioned soy sauce ramen. It's called shoyu ramen in Japanese. This is a ramen store called Yatai in Japanese. So we can enjoy ramen on the street. Not only ramen, Yu-chan serves oden, which is Japanese-style similar food. Bonus talks about the shop and food are already at the very end of the video. So I hope you enjoy this video till the end. Before then, I'll share about the shop first. Inside the Yatai is pretty big. It's covered by clear-cut plastic top, so it's very warm even in winter, and we won't get wet on the lade. This is the menu. Yu-chan mainly serves shoyu and tonkotsu ramen, plus oden, other Japanese side dishes and drinks. There's only Japanese menu, so if you are worried about food, please ask shop staffs. And today, I'll take Ajitama shoyu ramen, soy sauce ramen with seasoned egg. And also, I'll take some oden, which are these, pointed by arrows. This is oden. Many types of ingredients are being simmered in the big pot. A shop staff is going to prepare my oden. Let's see it for a while. This is oden. I'll share it later. Then the shop staff is going to prepare my ramen. Let's keep watching for now. My ramen has arrived. This is the food for today. I'll share from shoyu ramen. This is shoyu ramen with a seasoned egg. It costs 900 yen. It's about 6.63 US dollars. This is very classic style shoyu ramen, and this is the ramen from Yatai. It tastes simple, but this is the original style of shoyu ramen. Let's see it in detail. First one is soup. It's runny, but it smells very nice of chicken. This is authentically old-fashioned shoyu ramen. Chopped leek is on soup. Boiled spinach is also topped with ramen. 
texture and color are very nice. Pork belly char siu is on top. It looks so tender. This is Naruto. As you already know, this is the same one as Ninja Manga Naruto. Small piece of dry seaweed is nicely sunk into it. It produces great soup stock. Short and thick bamboo shoots are on the edge of the ramen bowl. This is very common topping for ramen too. This is my favorite topping, seasoned egg. It's called ajitama in Japanese. Last one are noodles. These are medium thin straight noodles. They look so chewy. Let's have ramen. Please subscribe my channel. Itadakimasu. Okay, let me share shou ramen first, and I'll show you soup for the first. Soup looks very familiar. It doesn't seem special at all. Let me have one. Okay, okay. I know this. It's really good. Soup is really runny, but it's so rich of chicken. The balance of saltiness is great. Chicken oil on soup also nicely makes ramen better. I try noodles next. Wow, it's so chewy. Noodles are not perfect, but they are chewy enough. Soup tastes light and simple, so medium thin noodles are well fed. This ramen tastes origin of ramen history. Chashu looks good. I'll have it. It looks amazing, isn't it? Oh, this is so good. Chashu is very smart, so it's really tender. I almost do not need to chew it. Chashu fat is soon melting in the mouth. I found bamboo shoots. I'll have them for the next. Oh, these are crunchy bamboo shoots. We often see same type of bamboo shoot. It's crunchy and slightly seasoned by soy sauce. It's one of the best topping for ramen. Another show comes next. Yeah, it's soft and good. This is natural, and this is also famous topping for ramen, but it's getting less and less popular in these days. Let's try boiled spinach. It's soft yet crunchy. Recently, spinach is quite unusual topping for ramen, but it used to be regular topping in last days. My favorite topping, seasoned egg, shows up for the last. I'll check softness first. It looks good. I guess it's pretty soft. Let's check inside. Oh wow! Egg yolk blows out! I don't want to miss it. I need to split it out carefully. It's wonderful! Please come closer to see it! Let's dip it into soup and have it! This is awesome! This is excellent! Egg white is very soft and egg yolk is still layer and oozy. This is one of the best seasoned egg I've ever had. It's a time to have water. Itadakimasu! It's good. I've shared everything about ramen, so I'll move on to oden next. This is oden. Japanese usually has it in winter. Various kinds of ingredients are boiled and simmered in tasty bonito stock soup. I'll share from soup. It seems very similar to ramen soup, but it actually smells and tastes completely different. This is gammo doki. We call it gammo. It's deep fried tofu mixed up with other ingredients. This is chikua. It's mashed fish that is wrapped around the bamboo, steamed or broiled. This is konyaku. It's also well known as konyaku. It's jiggly and soft. This is shirataki. It's almost the same as konyaku. It's just different form of konyaku. Last one is mochikin. Great food is secretly hidden in the deep fried tofu. Let's have oden. I'll have soup first. Oh. 
This has very gentle taste. Lamy soup has also gentle taste, but this is gentler. Bonit flavor is very familiar with Japanese taste. This is so tasty. I'll have big and long chikua next. Oops, this is so soft and so juicy. Chikua got so much oden soup inside. It's great. Chikua is a very common oden ingredient. There's a hole at the center. That's why it's called chikua. Next one is shirataki. Let me try. Mmm, it's so dense and chewy. Shirataki is from Devil's Tangyam. It's thin and very long like a noodle. It's really smooth. I'll have a gamoroki next. Oh, it's so soft and it tastes good of tofu. It's very enjoyable to have gamoroki because it's mixed up some veggies and tofu. Soft tofu, crunchy veggies, and tasty oden soup are best combination. Let's try konyak next. This is so chewy and it's dense too. Konyaku and shirateki are the same, but konyaku is bigger, denser, and chewier. This is one of the most popular oden ingredients. This is the last oden for today. It's mochikin. Itadakimasu! Oh, nice! Melted mochi is wonderful! Mochi, rice cake, and some veggies are loved by deep fried tofu. It's very similar, so mochi is very soft and tasty. I love it! So, this is all about yata yucha and ramen and oden. Yuchan is located in Monzen Nakacho and it takes about 2 or 3 minutes on foot from the station. It doesn't have any website nor social media accounts, so it's hard to find the specific location. But no worries, I put Google Map location in the description box. Business hour is from around 7 pm to 3 am midnight. Sunday is closed. Yuchan is very casual izakaya on the street. Come and enjoy latest try the Yatai shop. Shoyu ramen is really good. It's well prepared, so soup is very tasty. It's old-fashioned yatai-style shoyu ramen, so we can see how ramen it was and now is. This is a ramen that Japanese used to love. Oden is Japanese local similar food. It's easy to find it in winter, but it's quite rare to see it in summer. There are many different ingredients can be oden, so we can enjoy various kinds of oden ingredients depending on shops. It's local food, so this is very good for people who are on diet. I hope you love it and find out your favorite oden ingredient. Gochisou sama deshita. Ramen and oden have very gentle taste. These are great. I visited the shop the other day and I had gyokai tonkotsu ramen. It tastes so rich of bonito and tonkotsu. It's amazing that we can have this quality gyokai tonkotsu ramen at Yatai. Shop manager served me motsuyaki for special. These are grilled trap. It tastes sweet and miso and it's so tender. Let me share it as a last. Mmm, this is good. It's really soft. Many other food is ready and ready for you. Come and have great Japanese yatai food at Yuchan. I hope you enjoyed my videos. These are my recommendation videos that you may like. Please click the like button and subscribe my YouTube channel and follow my social medias. This is all of today. Have a good day and good night. Bye!